What is up guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today, as you can tell from the excitement on my face, I'm at another meet. Today, I'm at Provisions Cars and Coffee, a new meet to the channel. So if you haven't subscribed yet, be sure to hit that subscribe button right now. Stay till the end because there's a lot of cars that I want to show you. And if you're new to the channel, my name's Max and this is Not Your Average Car Guy. Now there is a second parking lot to this meet over there, right over there in the back over across my shoulder, but I will cover that in a second separate video apart from this one. I will also film a couple flybys if, you know, if I get the chance to film a couple interviews if I do get the chance to, but without further ado, let's get to the meet, shall we? First off, starting 911 on blue rims, rear ass on blue rims, C at C8 Corvette with an Air Jordan wrap. This one actually looks real nice. But in a lot of other C8s that I've seen as of late. 65, 67 Mustang. I, all I know is just that it's the first gen. I think it's the one with inline six inside of it. C2 Corvette. Let me see. Is this, this is an E-Class, right? Yeah, no, it was C63 S AMG. C6 Corvette, R35 GTR from the Provisions Rally. It's absolutely really nice. M4 G82, the competition spec. Think this is a Cayman? Or it might be just another 911. Yep, it's just another uh, 911 Carrera S. CA Corvette 992 GT3. Look at the exhaust tips on that one. Looking burnt. Center locks. Anything else? 992 Turbo S green on bronze. Look at the match of those colors. Those colors actually flow together. Lamborghini Huracan in like this mad army green. LP642. Alcantara's everywhere. Actually, no, it's not even just a Huracan. It is a Huracan Technica. So you get it on camera over here. Technica, there you go. Another 911 Turbo S 992. Let's see. Look at this one. These two 911s. I think that's a G. I think that's a GT3. And this one's a race car. Yeah, both these are GT3. So on. Let me go right around the back. Let me show you. see real quick for sure. Just make sure I'm right. Yeah, that is a GT3 cup, and I think this one's a GT3 as well. No PDK, surprisingly. Walking through here. In the back, we have a lot of BMWs here. As you can see from the shirt, I am a huge BMW fan. Starting off, F82 M4, my favorite M4. F80 M3, G80 M3. Love this one. Red on black always gets me. 392 Scat Pack Charger. E60 M5 with the legendary V10. Between the LFA and the E60 M5, I think they're really pretty close. Other than that, Carrera GT is also a rival of the engine sound too. Toyota Super Mark V. Let me see, what is this one? A F82 M4, another one. Aftermarket, actually no, aftermarket intake. I think that's a strut tower brace. I don't know my M5 generations, but this one is nice. Tell me in the comments, what do you think about the new M5? Is it too heavy to be an M car? Porsche 911 Turbo, 991. 
Is it 991? Yep, I'm right. G82 M4 competition. I think this is an M340i. Look at that Porsche Carrera. I actually have a Hot Wheels car. Not the same exact color, but the same exact model. 930. Yeah, it is an M340i. Not an M6, but still the 6 series always look nice. E46 M3. Six-speed manual transmission. Everything's mostly original on this one. Hearst equipped C3 Corvette. E36 M3. It's gold inside. See, he actually put a turbocharger in this one too. Think. I don't know what kind of generation is this M2. Uh, F80 M3, Audi R8. I don't think, it, is this the V10 one? I don't know if this is a V10, actually. McLaren 720S, one of my dream cars. Let me see, what is this? A, this is a Huracan in purple. Purple and silver Huracan. That one. That one is a GT3 on uh, aero discs. Look at this. Carbon fiber, along with center locks and carbon ceramic brakes. Another 720S. This one is a Spider and a nice looking blue. Alcantara is everywhere on this thing. Nine Eleven Turbo S Cabriolet. Let me see, Tycon Turbo S. That's a nine nine two GT three. Uh, is this a GT three? Nope, it's just a nine eleven Turbo. Acura Integra Type S. One looks. This one actually looks real nice. I'd rather take this over the new Type R. I forgot which generation, but I'd rather take this over the new Type R than anything else. Another Porsche, that one's a Cayman. <laughs> the Jordan Corvette is now leaving. Same, I covered this Porsche career already. This is a Acura TLX Type S. That's nice. R33. On sport race. Not only that, it's on sport race too. RB, engine cover painted green. Everything aftermarket. It's got Nismo stamped on here. Look at this, look how fat that strut tire brace is. It's about like three inches thick. Aftermarket air intake, Garrett Turbo. Big one too. Right hand drive, this is actually in fact a Nismo version. Actually looks real nice, not even a Nismo, it's also a V-Spec. Take a look at that. There is another E46 M3 over here. Parked in the back, away from all the people. Looks really nice. Leather's in actually really good condition. Interior is actually in really good condition, the whole thing. 5.0 Mustang, just another 911. CA Corvette with the Sir Haunt wrap. Thing, this is a SL63 AMG. Guys, can you tell me what is like this little, what's up with Mercedes and like this little mouse pad thing? Tell me in the comment section down below. Another C8, that guy covered him earlier. Supra Mark V C3 Corvette. What are you? Oh, you are a Nissan. 
Oh, this is a Nissan PAL. Yeah, it's actually my first time ever seeing one of these. I think one of the guys on Instagram, I think his name is P-Woof Talks Cars. Yeah, he covered this one. Now, I don't know what these things were made by, but it seems to me like this is like 60s, 70s design and styling. Even the door hinges are exposed on the outside rather than on the inside like every other car. Really, really cool. Going back. Think Mark 8 Golf R aftermarket intake turbo somewhere in the back. Yeah, there it is. Right there, so you can see it. Um, Mark 7 GTI, Mark 8 GTI. Woo! Look at this. It's a Z3M coupe. Actually, no, it's not even an M, it's a 3.0i, but still, it is a Z3 coupe. This is actually my dad's dream car. He's been wanting one of these for so long. But by the way, R34 GTR. Right hand drive, six speed. Everything, mostly, mostly, almost all the, everything's original. The interior, this is buggy. What's powering this thing? It looks like a, uh, seems to be a V8. I'm thinking LS swapped. It's a lot of power being sent to the rear wheels. Having little to no weight, you're gonna take off. I think, what is this? This is a Boxster S. This is an F-Type. F-Type what? Oh, it's just an all-wheel drive F-Type. Okay, good. Red convertible. The Jaguar I want is a, uh, what was it? SVR? No, 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 it's the uh, XESV Project 8. Look that up in Google right now. Lexus IS300. This guy does rollers, of course. Look at the whole setup on the gimbal and everything. Or if I Super's leaving. Oh no, he's actually pulling in. Camera. He's got the whole setup. Ooh, and he's got it on bags too. Detachable steering wheel and everything. Ankies. Carbon fiber hood as well. C8 Corvette. There's a bunch of Beetles over here. Volkswagen Beetle Cabriolet. Cabriolet Turbo. 50 Mustang Shelby GT350R. It's actually not a 50. It is a GT350R. Alcantara wrap steering wheel. Six speed manual. Apparently, this guy has been to Jack Swag's Cars and Coffee. I haven't seen this one so far. Red roll cage in the back, too. He's got a GoPro. More Beetles, more Beetles. C7 Corvette in this nice looking white. It has actually a Z06. C8, C8, C8. There's a bunch of C8s going down here. What is this? This is a, uh, oh, this is actually an old Chevrolet. Can't tell the model of it is. The badge on the side is worn off. I would love to have one of these. What are you? I, this is a Mercury. I know that for sure. But which model? Look at the mirrors. It's crazy. They actually have lights in them too, so you can see. They're like fog lights, but just on your mirrors instead. Bend seats and all. Ford Model A? I think this is a Ford Model A because the T's were like pickup trucks. Right? Or am I wrong? Whoa. 
Volkswagen T2 pickup. I actually want to have one of these in a uh, Hot Wheels pack. Show you guys an image of it right now. It's not the same generation of Volkswagen, but still, it's a T2 pickup. CA Corvette. Mustang, I think this is a GT, GT 43? No, 63S, my bad. Two Miatas, actually the one on the left is actually wrapped really nice. What is this wrap? Actually, that's sick. Actually, no, those are stickers, but still, that's sick though. This other Miata is on Koenig's roll cage, apparently. And has actually fitted a turbo system to it. Z06 is going away. It's actually more quieter than I thought. Uh, it's actually more quieter than I would like. Coming up to the front and looping myself around the way back, we have a ton of vendors out front over here. Actually, there's a lot of Hot Wheels cars too. Show them real quick. Wow, he actually customized these ones too. This man's actually got a nice collection. I like that Z. That Z looks nice. Let me see. Uh, that Civic looks nice too. That Mark IV Supra. What else does he have? <laughs> Whoa, he's actually got the treasure hunt too. Chevy Fleet Line, he also has that treasure hunt. I think that's an A case. He's got a Bugatti right here too. Let me see, what else does he have? Overall, a pretty solid collection. It's actually better than mine, I gotta say. Civic SI, Civic SI on blue, rims. Let me see, aftermarket intake. Think he put a new intake manifold on that, I'm not sure. I'll put the link down in the description for y'all. Gotcha, man. Pro charged 5.0 Mustang here. What is that? That is a Panigale V2. Actually, a really nice Ducati and expensive Ducati. I want one of those. Dude, how come I didn't see this guy before? Triple Vipers, not one, not two, not three, trip Vipers. First one, Viper GTS with the white racing stripes down the middle. Let me see, what is this second one? This is this is GTS? No, this is actually an SRT10. And a good looking blue. Look at the hood cuts on that thing. Fab. You wanna see under the hood? Yeah, sure. Let me see here. Take a look at this V10. Pro charge. Hooey. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. V10. Comment down below what's your favorite car. Sheesh. This one's also a Viper. I can't tell which model of this is. She looks really nice. Lexus. RCF. Can't tell you enough how much I love this car. RCF, uh, retractable wing, I think it's called Active Arrow. He's got it on Kanze's carbon fiber hood and all. It's this, I think it's this, the RCF, RCF Track Edition actually, IS500, and then an LFA. That's going to complete my Lexus collection. Challenger. LC5, 
LC500. It's nice looking green. A BMW 3 Series, it is not an M3. It's not an E30 M3, but still, it's a, 3, it's a 318 IS sitting on BBSs. Detachable steering wheel, aftermarket shifter, four point racing harness, roll cage, and I think this thing's been V8 swapped. Yes, it has. AMG GTR. I've only seen a regular AMG GTs. This one's different. Uh, Lamborghini Huracan Spider LP610 4. Just like any other Lamborghini, red on black, bucket seats, Alcantara's everywhere. McLaren Artura, this one goes crazy. Let me see. What is this? A, uh, this is actually a 600 LT. Carbon fiber hood, carbon fiber everywhere, matter of fact. It's got Velocity exotic cars. Apparently you can rent these things. What is this? I think this is 720S. Yes, this is a 720S. Aerodisc something? Can? Looks like Aerodisc. I don't know what these things are. Huge rear wing, dual exhaust. Guy's got his Instagram if you want to get it. Porsche Cayman GT4 in this nice looking purple color and a blue GT3 RS. Now, there are actually, there are actually a couple more cars that pulled in. There is a white Audi R8 on bronze rims, I think. A bunch of cars have actually pulled out, but another bunch has pulled in. Usually these guys come in groups. It's not just individually. Anyways, the little Nissan's leaving right now. Such a quiet little Japanese car. Anyways, that's gonna be it for today's video, guys. I really hope you enjoyed. Be sure to subscribe if you haven't already. Like this video, comment if you wanna see more car meets like these, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace. Oh, actually, by the way, um, the second video is gonna be coming out. I'm gonna cover that real shortly. I'll see if I can get some interviews if I can, and um, see if I can get some like people pulling out of the meet. All right, see you guys.